Thanks, Tony. My name is Matt Baca, and today on the list, we're going over some of the most hated bands and musicians in the music industry. Like number one, Kesha. She's talentless, and she looks like my dog smells. In her defense, male performers have been singing about binge drinking and late night partying for years and have not caught any criticism for it. So I see the double standard there, but she's still pretty gross. Number two, Smash Mouth. Hey now, yeah, your band sucks. No one likes you. You're lame. Number three, Dave Matthews Band. Now, I really like the good old DMB, but it seems like it's becoming more and more popular to hate them. I think I just have a bad taste in my mouth because I took Amber Bradford to a Dave show back in 03, and she didn't even make out with me afterwards. As a matter of fact, I think she just did her math homework the whole show. We could have at least held hands, man. Number four, Justin Bieber. Now this guy's not only just a music industry puppet, but he's also just a terrible person. He's been in the news for everything from racial slurs to spitting on his fans. It must be strange growing up in the spotlight, but somebody needs to give this kid a good spanking. I mean, look at Michael Jackson. He grew up as a star and he never got into any trouble. Number five, Creed and Nickelback. I put these two together to save time because I've literally never met anybody who actually likes these bands. But somehow, they're household names. They're just awful, doo-doo, F plus. Number six, the Eagles. They're like Nickelback, but for your dad. And number seven, Chris Brown. Just another terrible human being. I don't really dig Rihanna's music either, but I would never punch her in the face like he did. As a matter of fact, I used to work at this music store that used punch cards to punch in. And after a while, we just started calling it Chris Browning. For example, oh, my hours are gonna be totally messed up this week because I forgot to Chris Brown this morning. So there it is, a completely objectionable list of people that I don't like, especially the Eagles, man. So until next time, in New York City for Indie Scene, my name's Matt Baca. Tony, back to you.